I'm Peter, the parts advisor here at Dean Team Golf Cart Service Department. So your EasyGo RXV is no longer moving and you're stuck somewhere. The first thing you want to try is putting your cart into neutral like this. Under the seat you have your run and tow switch. You switch it to tow and you turn your key to the tow position. That should allow your cart to move freely. However, there are some cases where your cart is not moving and your run and tow switch is not working either. That's when we need to go into the wiring of the cart and manually release your electromagnetic brake so your cart can roll freely. In order to do this, you have your cover here and a couple of pins that you need to remove to get to the underside of the cover. There we go. Now there are directions on how to do this specifically on the top of the cover and on the bottom of the cover so you can do it correctly while you're out there. What it's going to tell you is you're, you have one, two, three, and four connection switches here. The one and the two are your cart's normal run operations and they function normally when your cart's functioning, functioning normally. But they don't function normally when your cart isn't functioning normally. So what you're doing here by removing this switch and swapping over, this switch is providing direct 48 volt power to your motor brake to release it. You need to make sure before you do this that your cart is on a level surface because as soon as you put this in, your electromagnetic brake is going to release and your cart is able to move freely at that point and it can roll away on you. When you do this, you should hear a click from your electromagnetic brake and that signifies that your cart is able to move freely. And then you can get your cart where you need to get it to be serviced. Make sure you try to move the cart in the neutral on position before attempting to route direct power to the motor brake. Make sure your cart is secured before you plug in the connector as your cart will be able to roll freely as soon as this is done. Move your cart to a secure location and disconnect the connection so your motor brake doesn't overheat. Do not tow your cart with the rear tires in an immovable position as this can cause damage to your motor.